Hi, my name is Ruth. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I've been a professional makeup artist going on 19 years. I've worked on many sets with many celebrity clients and I would love to show you how to get some of those looks. Well, I chose some of these items for my glam look because they are going to have a little bit more coverage. These are some of the foundations. Here I have several that are full to light coverage. It really depends on who you're, who you're working on. Uh, of course, my concealers. I'm gonna do a bronzy eye. So I'm gonna use uh, this Dior palette here. These are more foundations. I'm really into these milk gel bronzers. So I will also be using these. For Sam, because this is who, who our model is, she has a little bit of a sunburn, and so I'm trying to be as gentle, hopefully I am, mm -hmm. as possible, and I am trying to cancel out some of the, the redness first. Um, like red carpet look, we don't mind shine. It, you know, uh, if it's TV, there's certain directors that hate shine, and so we, we are always having to be a, be on top of that. Um, for red carpet, sometimes it's more, it's okay to have that little dewiness. And also some directors love to see dewiness. So it really all depends. The person in your chair, you have to make sure that they don't have allergies. You know, you have to ask if, if they do. Like I mentioned earlier, there's a lot of people with a lot of sensitivities now. Um, and so you have to sort of remember that. Since we're doing glam, we want to perfect the skin. And that's, that's why I'm taking my time. I love skincare. Sam knows it. <laughs> um, so I definitely prep time normally would take a lot longer. I like to do a mask on a client, um, especially before red carpet. I'd rather spend more money on skincare and, and make sure that your skin and your face is taken care of because that means that you're gonna use less makeup. And staying with the dewiness, I'm gonna use a cream blush. This is by Ilia, which is great. A great company as well. I'm gonna use this milk. These are some of my favorite new things now. Milk? Yeah, it's um, milk makeup. And these are one of the new bronzers that they have. Oh, for, for bronzers, you sort of wanna you know, we've all gotten sunburn or sun, a suntan. And the sun always hits us in the forehead, on our nose. So we, we're highlighting that with the bronzer. It becomes, I think if a lot of artists, I won't say everyone, but we're sort of perfect, like perfectionists. So we want to make sure that everything is right and looks good. And not just, I'm thinking ahead, it may look okay, me seeing it here, but is it gonna look good on the camera? It adds color, but it also um, doubles as like a primer. It helps the, the shadow, the eyeshadows stay. You can also use it as an eyeshadow, so I'm gonna use it as a base. Usually the rule is you find where your your fold is, where your when you close your eyes, you sort of feel your eyeball. Mm -hmm. And sort of that's usually where you want to concentrate on your darker colors. You could do whatever you want, honestly. Whatever makes you happy.
My favorite is doing red carpet. So there's been a few really good moments. I love a lash and a lip. And when a client wants like a nice red lip or can play with color, a nice pink lip and an eye full of lashes, it's like, it's classic. But generally speaking, if you add longer lashes towards the middle, it's sort of gonna balance out your eye. Once you wash your face at night, you know, whenever you're getting your makeup off, they just come out. That's the glue you wanna use. You don't wanna use glue that you, <laughs> from like, ex from actual extensions, no. Um, I was assisting in a salon. Owner of the salon, her husband was a producer for Law and & Order. And his friend needed an assistant on an independent film. That's how I sort of, and I had never done makeup ever, <laughs> but I needed the money. And so I said yes. And when I went to set, it was, my like aha moment it was i just fell in love with the whole chaos of that thank you so much for watching my makeup booth i really really appreciate it if you like what you saw like subscribe and turn on your notifications and also if there's anything specific that you want to see please comment below.